Oh my god. Before I get started with the recap, this is, so far this season, the biggest win for the New York Jets. There, that's no, there's no, there's no point in even debating that. This win right here was our biggest win of the season so far. You know, forget the whole, yeah, uh, we, I mean, every win's been big, but this is the biggest one. Before this game, every, every single person, I mean, everybody, there was not a person, except for the Jet, except for the coaches and players on the Jets, obviously, nobody thought the Jets could win today against Buffalo. Nobody. Everyone was like, oh, Buffalo's going to take care of business. They're going to beat the Jets by a lot, and they're going to win, and they're going to be, uh, they're going to have seven wins now. Uh, yeah, I'm sorry, but, uh, that did not happen. That did not happen. The Jets beat the Bills. The Buffalo Bills. One of the best teams in the NFL right now. We beat the Bills. The Bills right now are 0-2 against the AFC East so far this season. Their two, their, their two losses have been against the Jets or the Dolphins and the Jets. I, I cannot believe we won this game. I'm so happy. This is gonna be an this is gonna be an even more special victory Monday. And what's great about what's great about this what about this game is this was our first win against Buffalo since since um the 2019-20 season where we beat him in week 17 in uh Buffalo. Um I cannot believe we won this game. Um, we ended so yeah we, we 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 broke that streak finally. So we broke our losing streak against the Bills. Now we have to break our losing streak against New England. That's the next team we play. But before we play New England, we have a bye week. So yeah, we have this game. Then we go on a bye week. The thing is, the Patriots are also going on a bye week. They're not playing next week. So the. Jets and Patriots are on a bye week next week. We're not playing. I'm, I'm just going to chill on Sunday. I'll probably watch the Falcons game. Are the Falcons on a bye? I don't think they are. So, speaking of the Falcons, they lost today. Uh, sorry, Selena and uh, all the other Falcons fans. You guys had it, but yeah, you lost. Who do you guys play next? Uh, you play the... Oh, you play on Thursday night. Okay, well, I'm going to have to find a different game to watch. Um... So, the Jets win. I, I cannot believe this. The Jets win. We are 6-3. and three. The Bills are 6-2. and two. What a crazy fourth quarter that was. I was saying, after the Bills tied, tied the score at 17, I said, take your time. Don't rush. Take your time. And that's exactly what the Jets did, leaving the Bills with only like a minute and a half. And... I was getting nervous that the Bills, Bills were gonna use it well and they were gonna win the game. But the Jets won, and we finally beat the Bills. Everybody in, everybody was like, "No, we're not winning this game," but we do. Zach Wilson comes up. He he did so much better in this game. Apart from that fumble. Apart from that fumble. Oh wow, I'll talk about that later. Um, apart from that fumble. Uh, he did amazing today. I'm very proud of you, Zach. I'm so proud of you. So let's go to the game leaders. Josh Allen went 18 for 34, throwing for 205 yards and two interceptions. Those interceptions were by um, Jordan Whitehead and Sauce Gardner. Sauce Gardner has gotten his uh, second interception of the season. Rushing yards was Josh Allen. He, he can really run, too. Nine carries for 86 yards, and he got both Buffalo touchdowns. Both of them. Receiving yards was Stephon Diggs. Five receptions for 93 yards. For the Jets, Zach Wilson, 18 for 25, 154 yards, and one touchdown. Rushing yards, Michael Carter, 12 carries, 
76 yards and a touchdown. And that was in the first quarter. Or no, it was the second quarter. It was towards the end of the first half. And the receiving yards was Garrett Wilson, uh, eight receptions for 92 yards. Oh, my God. I, I, I don't have many things to say because I am so happy with this win. I, I cannot believe this. If you want to see my reaction, uh, I streamed this game so you can look at the ending to that stream. I went pretty crazy. Oh, my goodness. I cannot believe this win. Uh, I'm going to have to sign, I'm going to have to close this video out with, um, uh, just, just basically saying, uh, the Jets need to, uh, just rest up this week. Just rest up. You got a bye week. Get ready for New England. Another test against New England. Can we finally beat New England? What makes, what would make it even better is beating them in Foxborough. That's where we're playing next. We play the Patriots in Foxborough week 11. So... Yeah, I'm uh, I'm excited for that game. The Patriots today beat the Colts. Everybody in the AFC East won today except for the Bills. Everybody. The Jets beat the Bills, the Dolphins beat the Bears, and the Patriots beat the Colts. Everybody except the Bills won today. 3-1 and one was the AFC East. Uh, two teams are on a bye next week. That would be the Patriots and the Jets. I don't think the Dolphins are on a bye. At least I don't think so. Buffalo's already had their bye. Uh, let's see. Dolphins. The Dolphins are not on a bye. They are playing next week. Well, then their bye is after. Their bye is the week that the Jets play. So they won't be playing the day the Jets and Patriots play, and the Bills will play, and the Bills will play that day. So there you have it. The Jets win 20 to 17 over the Bills. Biggest win of the season so far. You never know. We could have a bigger win than this. And I will see you guys later. And go Jets!